What's up everybody, I'm the Man Goose. You are awesome and today we're going to be talking about Overprime's underrated feature, which is being able to just play by yourself. You can of course go into matchmaking and you can pick now between Legacy or Monolith, which is a nice addition. Then you have your, your, um, uh, what is that? Southeast Asian servers, I think, US servers, and then your EU servers. But that's not what we're going to be doing today. Today we're going to go to Create Listen Server, and then you can select your map here, either Monolith or Legacy. I'm going to go Monolith because I haven't played much on Overprime's Monolith map, and I actually prefer it over their Legacy map, even though I did prefer Legacy Paragon. So all we're going to do is hit Select Map here, and this is going to allow us to just queue in by ourselves. There won't be any enemies, there won't be any allies, there'll just be minions running down the lane, and this will allow us to test certain things, like find out what walls we can jump over, find out what cards work best, um, if you've got a jungler, you can find out, you know, when, you know, if, if you're able to, to, to clear out a full jungle, uh, without health pots or anything like that. Um, so now that we're in this screen here, we're going to hit force start, confirm, and it'll bring us to the character selection. I guess gadgets bugged out right now, I guess, because you can't, you can't pick gadget, but, uh, we're not going to pick gadget. Let's pick rampage. So we're going to lock in rampage. And for start. So if you're anything like me, you really don't care about ELO. Like, fight. I couldn't care less about how well I do in these very early iterations of these games. However, um, I do like to play my my best. I, I do like to do the best that I that that I possibly can, um, even if I don't care about the outcome. Like, I don't care if somebody else is off, you know, testing bugs and stuff. But I do want to, to, to do things as, as well as I possibly can. And being able to come in by yourself and test things out is a huge boon for that. And that is, that's not in Fault or Predecessor yet. You can only really do this in Overprime. So we got our jump pads here. The map is looking really good. They've made, uh, they've made some visual updates, it, it seems. So we hit our jump pads. We see our nice little cannonball jump animation. I really like that addition there. And we do have a speed boost as we come off the jump pads. We're going to take a look around through the jungle. Had a little bit of a frame rate drop there. Nothing to worry about. I do get some frame rate drops in Overprime. Not as much as, um, well, actually, you know, I played a game of Fault today and I didn't have, I had a few frame rate drops at the beginning, but that was it. It wasn't that bad at all. So, yeah, they've really done some good work in here. I really like this water. Overprime is looking better and better. Um, I've kind of, I, I kind of been sleeping on Overprime. Um, I, I will admit out of the three games, um, it's probably my least favorite to play. However, that doesn't mean that you guys won't like it. And uh, that means, you know, I'm still going to report on it in case you guys do want to play it. Get our last hit on a minion there. We see that there are jungle buffs. Let's go ahead and, or river buffs. Let's go ahead and take this. Oh, it just immediately destroyed it. So now we have the, uh, the red buff off of the uh, river buff. So that's pretty, whoa. Whoa, what's up with Orb Prime here? Why does he look... Like a McDonald's toy. What the hell is going on there? Um, I don't know if that's something to do with my settings or what, but yeah, that looks wild. So now what I want to test out, I should probably wait till this buff leaves, but I, what I want to test out is how well I fare against the, um, the minion camps at level one with just the lumberjack axe. So I can come in and I can start attacking these minions. And, uh, oh wow, yeah, they're they're actually dealing a pretty um, significant amount of damage to me. Let's give them the the boulder to the face. Only hit one of them with the boulder, okay. And, uh, yeah, oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, I would definitely not be able to clear out an entire minion without health potions. I'm going to activate my health potion now. I missed that jungle camp, the one that was outside of the uh, fog wall. I always like this one because th there's a lot of epic fights happened here because you didn't see, you would try to take the enemy's camp right here and you wouldn't see him coming through the fog wall or vice versa so all right we unlocked the ability let's get his e which uh he he has the rumble back like his e used to be um just king of the jungle loop which would increase his uh health regen in the jungle but now it's this rumble ability that they gave him towards the end of paragon which they took away his leap ability and gave him that rumble um he does have his oh my god these minions. The enemy tower is under attack. 
Holy shit, they almost killed me. Whew. But he, yeah, he does have his leap back in uh, in Overprime. So I'm afraid to even touch that green fucker right now. So what we're going to do is I'm going to go around. I'm just going to walk around and see where I can leap into. So this was a classic one, jumping up into the uh, enemy's gold buff. Uh, oh, this targeting reticle is... Okay, I made it. Made it just fine. Oh, God, I'm glad he didn't attack me. So, yeah, I can jump up in there with Rampage. Let's see if we can jump over into the enemy's jungle. Because that was a pretty high leap. Let's see if we can find a good entry point here. Nothing looks promising yet. Give me that. That's weird that it just one-shots like that. Oh, I'm out of health potions. So I'm, I might be able to jump over this wall. Well, can I jump over this wall over the over the river buff? So let's see what happens here. An enemy tower is under attack. Oh God. Okay, yeah, I don't think that was intended. An enemy tower yeah, I should not be able to jump up there like that. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if that's that, that's definitely not intended. Definitely not intended. Let's see if we can jump over this wall right here. You'd be able to really surprise the enemy jungler doing doing this. Did I, okay, nope. Seems like there's an invisible wall right there. I'll try it again. I'll give it another go. We'll give it another shot here. Ah, oh, I missed playing Rampage. Okay, nope. I definitely can't get over that. So that's nice. Good to know. Good to know. Oh, that oh, that. Or Prime is burning my eyeballs. Oh, oh, Lee Minions hurt too. Minions ain't playing today. <laughs> Minions ain't playing today. Now let's see if we could do the opposite. Let's see if we could jump out of our jungle and over to where like the river buff is. Looks like there's a bunch of trees and vegetation and such. Uh, nope, we didn't make it through. I'm glad they didn't attack me. You know what? I'll go to back because I'm very low on health now. Uh, and then we can come in here and try out items if we wanted to. Gives us a good chance to look through and see what we might actually want. Spiny stick, max health, and damage 5. That looks like it would be good on Rampage. Let's get a spiny stick. An enemy tower is Close out attack. the menu here. Cannonball on in. And let's give that a try again. Let's see if An we can jump out of the jungle. You know what? Let's take the, uh, let's take the, the jungle buff guy here. Oh, I just leveled up. Let's level up our Q. What the hell just happened there? Oh, I just dropped it. Okay, so that does pass through minions. Good to know. Oh, I landed right on top of him. That probably needs to be fixed. All right, we do have our shield. Just like the good, good old days. Maybe we can leap over right here. Oh, I keep not left clicking. There we go. Oh. Oh my god, I'm walking through the trees. Okay, so I was able to get into the river from that area. I don't think that was intended, but it's good to know for when you're in game. Let's try that again. Let's see if we can jump all the way over into their jungle. Did I just level up again? Jesus Christ. Okay, let's walk out onto the tree here. Let's wait for a cooldown. I'm going to try and leap again to see if I can get over into their... How far out can I walk with this tree? Oh, I'm scared. I'm scared to fall. All right. Oh. Oh, I bet I could make it. I bet, I bet if I kept practicing at that, I would be able to leap from our jungle into their jungle. <laughs> That's ridiculous. But yeah, you get the point. Um, it's it's great to be able to just run around in here by just all by yourself. Get to know the lay of the land. Get to know the map. Where everything... Oh, that ore prime. I wanted to look at Fangtooth. That ore prime just keeps... I'm like a moth to flame. And that is definitely burning my eyes right there. That ore prime. So some other fun things we could try. We could launch this boulder at stuff. We got Fangtooth here. I'm definitely not going to be able to take Fangtooth tooth at this level. Yeah. Oh, he's chasing me. <laughs> What's up there, big guy? 
Oh, I have a boulder. <laughs> That's funny. He chases you. That's another thing we could try. Is let's see how far we can launch our boulder. Do we want to? Do we want to kick a field goal from up here? No, we can't really see. Let's launch from over here. Let's try and hit that uh, that tower over there. So let's angle it up this way. Ooh, that uh, a little short, a little short, a little short. Get out of here, minions. I'm trying to do stuff. I'm trying to throw rocks. Watch me run out of mana. All right, let's see if we can go up a little higher here. Aim about right there. Oh, just shy again. Just shy again. Oh, we have our ultimate. wonder if that uh, will immediately reset the cooldown. Nope. Man. I think it's possible. I think it's possible. We're going to try one more time. Oh, I'm going to need mana. Have patience. Okay, let's launch it like that way. Oh, hey, we hit the tower. Okay, so that's uh, that's fun. Now I'm gonna go ahead and back out and try a different hero. I'm not sure who I want to pick, but uh, what does this buff give? Let's kill this guy real quick. Take it. Oh, this is just a gold buff. A gold buff in the uh, jungle. Okay, that works. Whatever, I like it. So I'm going to go ahead and exit out, and we're just going to we're back to the main menu. So I'm going to try another hero out on the monolith map. Oh, I don't want to match make. Uh, here we go. Select map. Try another hero out here on the uh, the monolith map, and then uh, we'll transition over to Legacy and see see what that's like. Who do I want to play? Who does Overprime have that nobody else does? Oh yeah, I got a four start. Confirm. Mmm. Shinbi. Oh, I miss Shinbi. Oh, I miss you, Shinbi. Oh, why'd they have to use the fucking epic voice lines? Because they're, they're terrible. They should just let me voice Shinbi. My name is Shimmy, and I've got a tiny little butthole. Um, let's go with the magic shards. Why not? And let's get her Wolf. So I'm gonna head into lane with her. Ooh. I don't remember her hair being that red, but. So the, the wolf used to just pass straight through minions. So we're going to try that out. And then, uh, oh yeah, once we unlock the dash, let's see if we could dash from this platform over to that platform. That always used to be fun on Shinbi. Oh, here comes the minions. Let's line up a wolf and hit him with it as they come in. Oh, whoa. Whoa, that's a weird targeting reticle. Uh, does it still go? It still goes through them. You have no idea what the range is on it though when it's like that. I don't. I don't know if I enjoy that much at all. Ugh, that noise too. What is that? Grrr! <laughs> I think her wolf is her. Her line rhythm. What's it called? Yeah, it's a little fucking off tune right now. Line tempo. There you go. That's nice to have the name of the uh, ability right there. Okay, so now we got the dash. Let's see if we can dash from over here back to our platform. Oh, what the hell? On cooldown, I was supposed to have two dashes. An enemy tower is under attack. An enemy tower. How does she not have two dash? She's supposed to have two dashes, right? You're supposed to be able to reactivate it. Did they change that? I wonder. Well, let's level it up again and see what happens. Let's see what happens. 
Oh, that's that sound is the equivalent to what the over prime the the prime buff guardian looks like. <laughs> oh, okay, we can't unlock it yet. Let's get um circle rhythm. Is that what it's called? Let's wait for these minions to come out. We'll we'll pop them with the uh, circle rhythm. Come on out, guys. Oh, what in the actual fuck is that? <laughs> okay. Okay, Soli. Soli. I'm trying to do you guys a solid. I, 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 have, I haven't given your game enough attention. I'm trying to highlight it for people now. But you can't have Shibby's fucking circle rhythm. <laughs> Sounded like a drunk monkey fucking a broken accordion. What is that, what is that shit? Gang! <laughs> Oh, that's terrible. This game looks amazing. Uh, they've done a lot of great things with it. I um, love the look of it. But holy shit. That, uh, they need to do something about Shimmy sound effects. Whew. <laughs> Alright. So now we've got level 2 for our dash. Hey, there we go. I just had to level it up. There we go. Now we'll see if we can get across the thing. I need to... <laughs> prevent myself from using mana here. Even though I really want to hit those wolves again. Let's see if we can dash across. Boom! We got it! Got all the way across. Oh, let's see if we can... Oh, there's no way we can get all the way over there. Let's see how far we can get, though. Let's run up in the jungle and get on get on that platform. Let's see how far we can boost Oh, can she jump in this tree? Uh, no. Doesn't look like it. Only Rampage can climb in trees. I like the nice little birds and stuff in the background. That's kind of cool. Alright, let's... Busto! Not just about the middle of the lane. That was fun anyway. Let's go uh, bust some jungle minions eardrums with, line, with, uh, with circle rhythm. So these guys were fucking Rampage up. Of course, I was level 1 with Rampage. Okay, and this should be healing me up. Looks like it is. Ugh, why does it sound so fucking terrible? Oh, that is horrid. Your skill rises. Ugh. And I do have all kill, but of course I cannot test all kill because there's no, uh... Ugh, let's hit, let's hit the glaringly bright or Prime here with this, uh... Oh, <laughs> gross. All right, let's get out of here. And uh, we're going to go check out the legacy map. All right, so let's pick another one. Grux, 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 Grux. Let's go with Grux. Uh, looks like we're forced into the uh, magma beetle skin thing, which I'm fine with. That was a badass skin. Prepare to fight. Hmm. I'll give him the old lumberjack axe again. Let's see how he stacks up to uh, his old rampage. And of course, in the um, let's get his chop online. And of course, in the uh, legacy version here, they do have travel mode. So I just exited it. I can hold shift, switching to travel mode, and boom! I flip my club around, and now I am in travel mode. You don't get the fun. Uh, you don't get the fun jumping animate animation from the tower, but you do get that. So everything is very, very, very reminiscent of a Legacy. We even got Shadow Wells here. One of my favorite things used to be, back in the day, back in my day, was to run up here. Oh, oh, can, can I, oh, can I, okay. I was going to say, can I not run up here? And if somebody was trying to uh, take, take this tower, you could leap off onto them and then uh, they would never see it coming. Just fly down on them and t take them out. Okay, minions should be spawned. Let's go find us a jungle camp and beat it up. Oh, they're not spawned yet. A few more seconds. A few more seconds. And again, if you do this on your own, you just get a feel for what it's going to be like to jungle in the game and what you'll be capable of. So when you actually do go in and play with people, 
you won't be embarrassing yourself by getting killed by jungle minions. Because that is always embarrassing. Yeah, they they jacked me up pretty good there. Maybe I'm not um, kiting them well enough. That is definitely not kiting them well enough. Okay. Yeah, this feels better. Just gotta do the old kiting mechanics. I probably could use my abilities too. Okay, yeah, so you definitely have to rubber band them. Um, I mean, I didn't take... I mean, I know I'm almost dead, but I didn't take nearly as much damage as I did with that first set of minions. Uh, let's... A health pot's not gonna be enough. Let's go ahead and back. Let's back. We, we killed one jungle camp. It's time to go back. It's, it seems like it's almost more worth it to just go to lane for a little bit before you go into the jungle. I don't want to start that meta, but... Meta. Better meta. So now we have our big old pull. Let's, you know, let's head to the lane and use the pull. Good old smash and grab. This thing used to be so fucking big in Legacy. That's another thing I want to take a look at at some time. Some point in time is the is if there's a difference in the abilities between. Nice! Between their Legacy and Monolith maps. I don't believe there is. We'll do that right after this. We'll, we'll see if uh, Smash and Grab is smaller. Okay, now we got our dash. Wait, they took... Is it the dash or the char you can... Oh, it's a dash into a double chop. Does that double chop actually do anything? Let's see. No, it doesn't. Okay. That's fine. It's fine. And we do have some river buffs here. These are not one shot like the uh the ones on the monolith map. I'm gonna take a look around and then we're gonna do another smash and grab so we can compare contrast and compare. Does he yeah, he still looks like absolute dog shit in on this map too. Why is this? Why did they do this this way? I wonder if there's like a reason for it. <laughs> Look, that purple thing looks like his mouth. Like he's going, Hey! Hey, guys! <laughs> hey, look at me! I'm real yellow! Alright, let's... Let's head over the side lane here. And I... Th think, if I'm correct, they put some gold buffs on the sides. Over they did! I am correct. Take this guy real quick. And you can, you know, auto attack immediately into a double chop, which was one of uh, Grux's strengths back in the day. So let's go ahead and put this smash and grab down. Okay, that wasn't a good representation. I need to get a better overhead view on that. An tower is under I don't even care if it hits anything. I just want to see how far it extends. Eh, okay. So now let's go back into Legacy on Grok, or uh, Monolith on Grox and see if his abilities change at all. Uh, back to main map menu. There we go. We'll just pick up the old Lumberjack Axe again. Health Potion, Mana Potion. Good to go. Yada yada. Uh, let's get the double chap. What's his... Oh, uh, he doesn't have an interesting one. Oh, well. Yeah, Grux don't fuck around. He don't play. He don't do flips and shit. He's Cirrus. He's a Cirrus jungle. Jungler. You know, it seems like everything spawns all at once. Is this... Okay, I think that's Raptor Pit. Oh, I really don't want to look at this Ord Prime again, but I want to see if he spawns at the very, very beginning of the match, just like everything else. Minions are spawning. 
We'll find out in 29 seconds. Or maybe this is where Fang... Because this looks like where you would duck the orb. Oh, no, no, no. I see where... Okay, we're going to take a look at that, too. We're going to take a look at the prime dunk pits that they added to this monolith map. Okay, there's Fang too. Okay, so he spawns in right immediately. Can I just one-shot this thing like I was with Rampage? I can indeed. And I'll, I'll, I'll get the uh, smash and grab leveled up next. Okay, yep, there's we're Prime already spawned in. I don't think anybody would want to mess with him at this point in time, but he is there. A little harder to kite in here because of the cramped quarters. Okay, these guys are messing me up, but uh, seems like I do have faster clear time than Rampage. Let's get the smash and grab up and going. Then we'll then we'll unlock his E to see if it's the Sharyuken or if it's the Dash. All right. Seems like it's about the same distance. Okay, and... Okay, yep, still just the dash. Oh, wow, that seemed like he kind of left the ground when he did that. We'll, we'll try that again here in a second. We'll get some elevation before we do it. Yeah, he, yeah, he definitely did, just travels in a straight-up, straight line. Doesn't fall at all. Until the end of is the uh, animation there. Okay, now let's go take a look at where you would dunk the uh, orb prime. So you can see the little offshoots on the map there. And boom, here it is. And it looks pretty much exactly like the one on Legacy. Except it's on Monolith, and it even has a Shadow Well. And we got out here. Oh, so pretty. Don't do it, Grox. You got so much to live for. All right, guys. I think that's uh, going to about do it. Um, anything you can think of, anything you want to see tested, um, you can do it yourself. You can anybody can download this game. It's it can be a pain to download. I know that. Um, they have made some strides with the launcher. Their their UI looks a lot better now, but they have made some strides with the launcher. So it shouldn't be that big of a problem to download it. So if you do want to come in, just buy yourself, play some of the heroes that you kind of miss. And just experience both the Legacy and the Monolith map. Um, you know, just hit up Overprime, hit up their Discord. I'll have it linked in the in video description below. And you can check them out. So uh, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, go ahead and hit that like button. Uh, subscribe if you want to see more. But for now, this is the Mangu signing off. You guys, have a good one. Mangoo!